decided to please and not waste paramedics' time by ringing them and saying I'm dangerous. I don't bring up, no, I never ring up the police because they're a waste of time and I never ring up the paramedics because they won't do nothing unless That's you want true. to. So I don't, I never ring, so don't blame me for ringing them up because I never, never, never ring them up. Well, Unless it's an Victoria, Victoria, the landlady, said that she got you to ring them. No, I never ring them. Oh. I don't even know the number, Brian, so I cannot, so don't okay. blame me. Okay, I'm only saying what, what, okay. what, what Victoria said to me. Because, you know it's not me. Because when the, Vic, when the paramedics turned up, they made out that you had made out I, you felt unsafe with me. Uh, and twice now you've told me where rope is to hang myself, so I'm well, just... You, you can please yourself a bit there. Yeah, well, I know, well, you know, um, <laughs> I'm just saying, don't, please don't waste their time, because I was actually in tears to the support worker about what you said to me, so, you know, I'm just saying that's all. People dying in A&E up and down the country. I've been assaulted and attacked, me and my partner have. And I never, never, never bring the police because I, I don't think they would do anything anyway. Well, you did ring the police with the with, with, with that attempted illegal eviction. No, I didn't ring the police. The, the locksmith ran the police. I said oh, I was going to ring the police. Oh, right, well, you... <laughs> but he, he went up and saw you and came down and the police. You've certainly helped the landlady out, though, haven't you? So, and this, as I said, well, you know, everything else I've already said, you know, this, one, this woman that you hate, you told me that you hate, that has assaulted me. Oh, you changed the record, you keep on the Yeah, no, well, well you're going to hear it forever, you know, because you really don't care, you really don't care. I don't care about you. I know you don't care, you only care about yourself. Exactly. Absolutely right. Victoria said you were a gentleman. You kissed my hand and you said what a lovely lady I am when I moved in here. You were a nice lady. And you made up all these stories about the door being left open, the front door being left open, the fridge door being left open. Oh, and then you apologised, you kissed my hand and you said, oh, I'm going through such a hard time, I've lost my daughter. And then, and then I'm terrorised by this woman, and I've recorded.